In this short video, we're going to share the flexible and powerful modeling capabilities of IQGO's Network Manager Telecom software. In this particular example, we will review distributed TAPPON architecture in Network Manager and explore the solution's ability to model any architecture you choose for broadband service delivery and define those assets in any degree of detail. Using Network Manager Telecom, you can configure PON distributed TAP network architecture for any network vendor's equipment. Configuration options in this example include designed light loss parameters, customer TAP port counts, inside or outside plant placement, optional internal splits and splice trays, pre-configured cable stubs, and any other attribute information needed at an equipment or specification level. Before you begin reviewing your distributed TAP architecture in Network Manager, take a quick look at how the MST and fiber TAP objects will render on your equipment layer. Next, zoom into a location where you have a large pedestal containing a splice closure and distributed TAP device along with their associated internal and external cabling. By selecting the pedestal, you can see its properties as well as a fiber tap and splice closure, along with some splice connections on tray one and some drop cable assignments on the fiber tap outputs. With the pedestal selected, you can dynamically render a structure schematic view, giving detail about the internal and external cable routing in the network and fiber pair range splicing on the tap and in the splice closure. You can return to the detail pane and select the fiber tap location. Looking at its individual properties and spec properties, it shows the power split ratio with through and drop loss. Transitioning to the splice connection between your splice closure and the 15 foot jumper cable connected to the common port on the fiber tap, you can initiate a downstream trace to all your customer terminations associated with this splice. In the trace detail pane, you can see each point along with its trace and their individual light loss and cumulative losses. From the details pane, you can easily export a tabular report of the entire trace route to all of its terminations. You can also choose to view this trace result as a schematic and export the schematic view along with its associated tabular detail. Whether it's distributed or home run pawn, active ethernet, centralized split, or converged front hall and back hall cellular networks, IQGO's Network Manager Telecom software allows you to rapidly and easily define complicated fiber network architectures at any level of required detail using a simple configuration user interface. Once these networks are designed in the office or field and fine-tuned, information documented in Network Manager Telecom offers very flexible reporting options to support network operations in the office, the NOC, and with your mobile workforce. Thank you for your time, and please check out our other Network Manager Telecom demo videos.